Friends of Islam, this time Islamic circles are back in front of you to share Islamic information, hopefully inspiring your activities today. And don't forget to click the subscribe button and activate the bell button notification so as not to miss the latest news from the Islamic circles channel. In the ever-evolving scientific world, we often come across discoveries that reveal the amazing connection between religion and science. One such example is the research on the sujud position in prayer, which has attracted the attention of many scientists. They find in sujud a depth of spirituality and tangible health benefits. In this video, we explore the scientific perspective on the position of sujud and the wonders revealed through research. It invites us to see prayer as an extraordinary practice through science. The sujud position from a scientific point of view. Apart from being an act of worship that connects humans with Allah, prayer also has tremendous benefits for physical and mental health. One of the important things in running the prayer is high concentration in every movement. But there are also some people who tend to rush the prayer so that it is finished immediately. There are two movements that people often do quickly in prayer, namely Ruku and Sujud. They may think that the world is more important than themselves. They may think that this world is more important than appreciating every movement in prayer. In fact, the movements of Ruku and Sujud in prayer have great benefits, both medically and spiritually. The Prophet Muhammad commanded his people to prolong the movements of Ruku and Sujud, because in these movements there are extraordinary virtues. In a hadith, Prophet Muhammad said, Indeed, if a servant stands up to pray, all his sins are brought and placed on his shoulders, then every time he ruku and sujuds, these sins fall away. This hadith shows that the longer the ruku and sujud, the more sins will be removed from the person. It turns out that the benefits of ruku and sujud are not only limited to the spiritual aspect but also provide significant medical benefits. In a study conducted by scientists, it was found that slow and solemn ruku and sujud have a positive impact on health. In the Quran, Surah al maida verse 58, Allah says, And when you call the prayer, they make it a mockery and a game, and such is because they are a people without understanding. This verse has shaken the minds of scientists to research the movement of prayer with ever-evolving science. The story begins with Dr. Fidelma O'Leary, a biology professor from Edwards University in Austin, Texas, USA. Dr. Fidelmo was awarded the Woman of Spirit Award in 2012 and is a neuroscientist at the University of Texas. She has done fascinating research on the nerves in the human brain. As a neurology doctor in a hospital, Dr. Fidelmo was fascinated by the complexity and wonder of the human brain. But there is one thing that surprised him. In his research, Dr. Fidelma found that there are some human nerves that are not entered by blood. This is an interesting discovery because every inch of the human brain needs an adequate blood supply in order to function normally. But there are certain nerves that don't seem to need blood to function. Dr. Fidelma also deepened his research and finally found that these nerves only need blood supply for a very short time, namely when someone is praying in a sujud position. In the sujud position, blood is pumped instantaneously to these nerves, providing the needed supply for a few moments. This discovery was a turning point for Dr. Fidelma. After scientifically researching the sujud position in prayer, he became interested in learning more about Islam. Dr. Fidelma began to find out about Islam through Islamic books and discussions with his Muslim colleagues. With full awareness and great conviction, Dr. Fidelma finally pronounced his Islam by saying the two sentences of the Shahada. His decision to embrace Islam was driven by his scientific understanding of the benefits of the sujud position in prayer and other discoveries he made in his research. Dr. Fidelma, now known as a devout Muslim woman, did not just stop at her decision to convert to Islam. She also decided to share her knowledge with others through her medical practice. Dr. Fidelma opened a clinic called Treatment with the Current, 
where she uses verses from the Quran and recommendations from the Hadith of Prophet Muhammad in the treatment of her patients. The clinic provides various Islamic treatment methods, including the use of fasting, honey and olive oil, among others, in accordance with the instructions from the Quran and the Hadith of the Prophet Muhammad. Dr. Fidelma continues to study and develop Islamic medicine and treats her patients using a holistic approach that includes spiritual, mental, and physical aspects. Through her knowledge and expertise in biology and neurology, Dr. Fidelma has found peace in Islam and applies it in her medical practice to benefit the health and well-being of humanity. Scientific research continues to contribute to understanding the benefits of prayer movements from a health perspective. One of the most interesting studies was conducted by scientists from Binghamton University in New York, USA. In their research report, they mentioned that prayer movements performed correctly and regularly can cure back pain. The study, entitled An Ergonomic Study of Body Motions During Muslim Prayer Using Digital Human Modeling, involves statistical analysis based on prayer movements generated by computer-driven digital models. The researchers compared digital models suffering from back pain with healthy ones. The results showed that the sujud movement in prayer has a positive effect on the health of the back. Professor Dr. Mohammed Hassana from the University of Dinghanton said, one of the ways the movement of prayer is similar to yoga or physical therapy, which is used to treat back pain, According to the researchers, the sujud movement in prayer can improve joint elasticity and help heal back pain. They also suggested that people should extend the time they sujud in prayer, as longer sujuds provide greater benefits. The study also showed, however, that improperly performed sujuds can increase pain. Further studies are therefore needed to identify the most appropriate movements for individuals with different physical conditions, such as people with physical disabilities, extreme body types, and pregnant women. The findings of this study provide further scientific support, especially for the health benefits of prayer movements. It reminds us that prayer not only has a spiritual dimension, but also contributes significantly to maintaining a healthy body. With this understanding, we are further reinforced in the importance of praying solemnly and understanding the benefits contained therein. Benefits of the Sujud Position In the world of science, prayer is not only a form of worship but also a means to maintain health, strengthen muscles, increase flexibility, and improve cardiovascular conditions. The Sujud movement in prayer not only has spiritual significance but also provides various health benefits. Sujud by lowering the body to the ground has a positive impact on the body and mind. Various studies have been conducted, and here I just summarize the conclusions and points. 1. Oxygen to the brain During Sujud, the position of the heart is above the brain, so blood can flow better into the body. This allows an adequate supply of oxygen to the brain which plays an important role in improving the function of billions of nerve cells in the body. Smooth oxygen flow to the brain also helps relieve headaches, sharpen the mind, and improve one's mental quality. 2. Improves the digestive system The movement of bending the knees and ruku, the body affects the position of the organs in the abdomen. This position helps improve blood flow to the digestive organs and their working functions. In addition, suju can also resolve muscle spasms and cramps, helping to maintain digestive health. 3. Promote Lymph Flow The suju position that places the forehead, nose, knees, both palms, and fingertips on the floor helps to promote lymph flow in the body. Smooth lymph flow to the neck, armpits, and head has a positive effect on the overall health of the body. 4. Improve Fertility and Female Organ Health The movement of sujud has tremendous benefits for women. Both ruku and sujud can help maintain fertility and the health of the female organs. The contraction of the abdominal muscles and peritoneum that occurs during sujud can strengthen these muscles as well as increase blood flow to the area. 5. Smooth Breathing 
During sujud, the movement of the body that presses on the diaphragm area helps smooth breathing. This is very beneficial, especially for individuals with breathing problems or disorders such as asthma. Sujud also helps to open up the respiratory tract and improve lung capacity. 6. Prevents Hemorrhoids The sujud position, with the body upright, helps prevent a person from developing hemorrhoids. This position increases blood flow to the perineal area and prevents swelling or tension that can cause hemorrhoids. 7. Strengthens the body's muscles The movement of suju followed by rising to one's feet can strengthen the muscles of the body, especially the calf muscles. When rising from suju, the weight of the body is placed on the arms and palms, providing contractions to the chest muscles that can help strengthen these muscles. 8. Improve Posture In scientific view, the movements of Ruku and Sujud in prayer can help improve posture, increase joint flexibility, strengthen muscles, and increase the flow of blood and oxygen to various parts of the body. Scientific research conducted by experts also supports the health benefits of these movements. By understanding the health benefits of Sujud, Muslims can be more motivated to perform sujud solemnly. Sujud movements that are correct and regular not only bring spiritual blessings, but also have a positive impact on physical and mental health. Well, viewers of Islamic circles, until here our encounter this time, hopefully inspire you all. See you in the next video. Thank you.